Hey guys, Ricardo here. Welcome to another Blog Tech Tips. In today's tutorial, guys, I'll show you on, on the MacBook, any MacBook, how to open a new private window. So if you're on Safari and you want to open a private window that allows you to browse in private, this um, tutorial is just for you. So the first thing you want to do, guys, is go ahead and click on the Safari browser. You'll find it down here. So go ahead and click. Once you do and launch the Safari browser, you'll be in here. And of course, because um, of that, you'll notice a context-based menu here that has changed according to what's open. So notice it says Safari here. Go ahead, um, guys, and click on the option that says Safari. Next, move over to File. Once you're on File, you should see the option that clearly says um, New Private Window. So go ahead and Launch. Now notice there's a new window that has popped up above the current one. And this is your new private window, meaning anything that's done within this window or anything that's open up in this new window will be a part of the private um, window or private search. Notice it says search or enter website name here. So if you want to do a search, go ahead and enter the uh, parameters there. Or if you know the website, go ahead and enter it there. Now private browser um, enabled or the feature once enabled, it basically will keep your browsing history private for all tabs in the window, meaning in this particular window. And it says once you close the window, Safari won't remember the pages you visited, your search history or autofill information, meaning anything um, that's entered while browsing in this mode will not be stored. So you can go ahead and go to your website by typing it in or just do a search. Once you're finished, guys, you can simply go ahead and close out. And once you close out, you'll be back to the normal browser. Notice the normal browser as there's no one in here on the top. So that's how to open up a private um, browser um, using Safari. If you have any questions, please ask them below. As always, Ricardo Garden from Blog Tech Tips. And bye until next time. Bye.